Pope, 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 What was that? Uh, just make sure they get my good side this time, okay? <laughs> what was that? I don't have a good side. <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> You're fired. <laughs> what was that? Oh, breaking news. This just in. Your favorite anchorman here, Arthur. Any more donuts? We have some special news. This just in. Something is afoot. Smelly. Gigantic feet have suddenly taken over the city of Glendora. The stench is contagious leaving its footprints in grocery stores, restaurants, schools, and even amusement parks. Looks like these little piggies are really going to the market. <laughs> it's good, I write my own stuff. Citizens are scared, fleeing the city to, well, less smelly places. This is no fun, guys. Who will nail down these feet and rescue our town from this terrific invasion? It will be no small feat, folks. I smell them, they're dry. They're smelling, they're coming in and get me. Oh, 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 I thought you were a giant foot. My goodness, well, look at you. Little scaredy cat there. What is wrong with you? There's so many smelly feet. They're all out there. They're coming in and get me, Granny. Too much TV. My pup. <laughs> My Polly Wally. Why, you seem to have forgotten just who you are. Hmm? What? Yeah, but don't you remember? Why, you are my famous, always prepared party to the rescue. <laughs> Me? Oh. Well, yes. Don't you remember? Fly to the rescue of so many who are not prepared through weather, forgotten lunches, missing science projects. You have saved so many. Oh, oh, oh boy. Oh, 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 oh Granny, oh, oh, yeah. Granny, okay. that was uh, a long time ago. All right, and, and this was before the giant feet oh. were destroying and taking over the city. No one was prepared for that. Well, you're right about there, Polly, I'll give you that. Now, none of us was ready for this stench to take over our city. <laughs> but there is someone who knew it was coming, and hey, he was prepared. <laughs> really? Yep. Mm -hmm. well, who is that? My child, my goodness, have you forgotten everything I've taught you? Why, I'm talking about the one who parts the seas. Why, he, 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 he takes down the walls of Jericho. He saves us from our fears, delivers us from the evil one. I'm talking about Jesus. Oh, wait. You mean God knew all this would happen? <laughs> Darn it. Well, yep. why would he let this great foot invasion happen? Well, there's only one place to look for that answer there, Polly. <laughs> it's in God's holy word. Yep, let's look up. Let's let's look at the book of Judges, huh? We find a man, a fearful man, named Gideon. Gideon? Yep. Gideon. And the other Israelites, why they were hiding from their enemies. Oh, the Midianites. But God, oh, he heard his people's cry for help. Help the Lord! And why he heard Gideon and he appeared to him saying he was going to use him to help save their enemies. Ha ha! Well, look at right here. Right here. I, I'm, not, I'm not sure I want to. Judges. Right here, Polly. Come on. Got to learn God's word. Right here. Judges 6, 12. It says that an angel of the Lord appeared to him. Oh, the glory. <laughs> and, and he said to him, the Lord is with you, oh mighty man of valor. Wait, wait, wait. Yes, he's with him. He called Gideon yeah. a mighty man of oh, valor? Oh, yes. I thought you said he was scared and hiding from his enemies. Well, he was. He was a big scared of cat indeed. <laughs> but you see, Polly, Gideon, well, he may not have been a, a mighty man of valor, <laughs> a great warrior, but God knew. God knew all the great things that he'd do through him. Gideon just had to put his trust in God. <laughs> Did he? Well, 
<laughs> he had a lot of excuses, <laughs> like someone else I know. Oh, you know what I mean? Granny! <laughs> oh, don't you be rolling those big brown eyes at me now! They're, they're hazel. Right. Well, you best see what the good Lord told Gideon. Well, it says right here in Judges 6, 16. And the Lord said to him, but, mm, I will be with you, and I, you shall strike the Midianites with one man. You see, Pilate God, he didn't send Gideon off to be fighting his enemies all by himself. No, he was with him every step of the way. Uh-huh. That's right. Oh, 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 oh. Well, well <laughs> that's, a, that's a nice story, Granny. Yeah, it's true. true <laughs> but, uh, I don't think I can be like Gideon. Well, now, you listen here, you little whippersnapper. You'll be just like Gideon sitting over there all scared of cats. My goodness. Don't you know? God's called you, Polly. Well, he's called you to save your people. All you gotta do is just put your trust in him. Let him do the work. Really? Well, yes, old Polly, my dear girl. He ain't, he ain't gonna leave you. But he told Gideon he'd be with him always, and he's gonna be with you every step of the way. That's right, he is. He's a promise. Good Lord don't break his promises. I know I've lived long enough to know these things. You best listen to me. Now, it also says right here in the Good Commission, Great Commission right here, Matthew 28, 20. Mm -hmm. Um, mm. and behold, uh -huh. I am with you mm. always to the end mm. of the age. That's right. Wow. That's right. Mm. <sighs> Thanks, Granny. Mm -hmm. I understand. I don't need to be afraid because God is with me. <laughs> well, that's my little folly wally. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey, Granny, mm -hmm. what did happen to Gideon? Oh. Did he win the battle? Uh, how big was his army? Ooh, and what did he fight with? Wow, now you want to know. Now, have we got some curious minds to work it with? I'll best leave this with you. Now, that's your homework there, Polly, okay? Okay. You best look up judges. Sit and that's your homework there, too. Yeah, don't be thinking that you can just get off the couch now and go and play your video games. No, you best read the good word of the law and look up Judges 6 and find out what happens to Gideon. And I'll see you in a week. I gotta go finish my socks. See you later. That's a wrap. <laughs>